Thank you. Um, yeah, what's really exciting for us is the, the number of organisations that are talking about uh, cloud-based solutions. Um, I've come across a number of companies that actually have a cloud-based uh, strategy um, and one of the key areas that they're finding is that their payments platforms are the only platforms that aren't cloud-based. So they're looking to bring those into line with the rest of the strategy. Well, we're showcasing rather coincidentally uh, cloud-based solutions. Uh, Compass Plus has one of the best cloud-based solutions uh, on the market. Um, ahead of our competitors, we've been involved in this for some years, uh, and our product Transaxis is fully uh, cloud-based, built from the ground up, rather than uh, add-on for later on. So we call that cloud native, uh, where we actually constructed the product with the cloud in mind. That's a great question because we're in a market of quite a heavy competitive nature. Um, and some of the really big guys uh, are really pushing in terms of financial backing. Um, how we differentiate ourselves is we would say that we would be the last migration that you would ever have to make. Um, with legacy, or you have a lot of uh, difficulties, um, 20, 30 year old systems. But we have both a, a license based solution and a processing solution. And so if you were to license our product and at some point in the future decide to divest yourself of the operational capabilities and move to a processing based solution, we can do that for you seamlessly. This is very unusual in the market uh, and one of our unique offerings. Well, latest news, uh, we've got a number of new clients that came on board this year. Um, we have a number more that will also come on board. Uh, we're venturing out into new countries, um, talking to some people in the Baltics and Central and Eastern Europe, uh, Western Europe, and, and also Scandinavia and the Nordics, um, which have a very heavy focus on the, on the uh, cloud-based solutions. Uh, of course, we are continuing to upgrade the product and produce new functionality for alternative payment methods, APMs. Uh, and really staying with the market and getting ahead of our competitors. Crypto is still in the wings, uh, lots of companies have started to accept it, but integrating that with payments platforms is, is not a straightforward process. Fortunately we have a very flexible platform so we can do that. Um, other alternative payment methods will come along, uh, there's quite a heavy emphasis on fraudulent activity as well with PSD2 and PSD3 now. Um, we're looking at sort of KYC, SIM swaps, these sorts of things. Subtle things that we can partner with maybe mobile network operator aggregators um, and get access to mobile data that others maybe can't.